I'm with Lisa Cameron of the South Wales Evening Post, which is organising today's Get Welsh event. Lisa, tell me what it's all about. Well, the Get Welsh Festival is all about supporting local produce and Welsh produce, so food and drink from around the area, and also as well as the celebration of the talent that we've got here in Wales. And also it's about bringing people into the Swansea City Centre and letting them see what we have to offer here to fund aid for all the family. They'll find everything basically for local Welsh produce including cockles, lava bread, we've got Welsh cakes, chocolate chip Welsh cakes, berry Welsh cakes. We also have Welsh brew tea here, we have Welsh um, cum dairy vineyards, lots, lots more. I'm with Carol Watts of Penn Cloud, who knows a thing or two about cockles. Carol, tell me about your history, history with cockles. I was brought up with the cockles with my great grandparents and grandparents. We had a farm and they had the cockle factory on the farm. In those days, we used to wash the cockles in the river. Oh, okay. And I gather you're wearing something that's got a, a real family history for you. It has. I got my great grandmother's Welsh costume on today, uh, her shawl and the two coats they got on and she died in 1965. Uh, she was 87 when she died and is about 120, 125 years old. Blimey. And tell me what goes well with cockles? Oh, bacon and lava bread. Nothing better than St David's Day breakfast, bacon, cockles and lava bread. There we are. Thank you very much. Thank you. We're getting Welsh today and for getting Welsh you can't beat a bit of choir singing. Take it away lads. <laughs> 